Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Would you call it 4 5 1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4 2 3 1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them, and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Here's the Milan team. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Alessio Romagnoli plays alongside Simon Kerr in central defence. And the striker is someone who can finish with the best of them, Ante Rebic. The first leg of this Europa League quarter-final is underway. Maciej Ribus. Chananolu, and a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, as we can see, if a striker is free in the box and the great ones just stand still, they know chances will come in that position and he wasn't disappointed. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. He's in behind. In it goes! That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here's the replay, and as we can see, the defence can't cope with the through ball. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Teo Hernandez. Can they take advantage? to catch it perfectly and didn't he just let's have another look at this he wasn't expecting the ball but when he comes to him he chooses early to volley it what a finish well the goal again albeit from a different angle full time and at the end of this first leg it's Milan with the advantage well, it's almost job done after 90 minutes, Derek. They need to be professional in the second leg, approach the game in the right way, but I'm surely they're going to do that. What a performance. And the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Lee. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him. And Milan's lineup looks like this. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. Benassa. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, as we see it again, the 1-2 is so hard to stop when it's done like that. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. 
And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Well, they could run onto it here. He takes aim. Well, off the bar and out of play. Close. Yeah, close indeed. Technique just leaning back a little bit. That's why it goes so high. Rade Krunic. It's a weight and pass. Sends it back. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, here's the replay. That full-back cross is so hard to defend against. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. The Rosso Neri pushing forward with options of it. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. It was so quick to get out from the back. And it's all about the time he allows himself by being patient, waiting for the ball to drop, and then volleying with such precision. Krikoviak. Real chance. Can he finish? A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, it is good play. You might question the defending, but I prefer to be positive. Really good build-up and an easy finish. Let's have another view of that goal. There's the final whistle. The home fans are jubilant. They are going through. Well, you can't say, Derek, they didn't deserve it. By far the better team over two legs. All departments of their team was functioning well. The midfield dominated and up front they were clinical. impossible to ask footballers to produce magic every single game and it didn't quite happen for him tonight well he did okay i suppose he'll be down because of the result there's no doubt about that but he'll look at his own game and ask whether he did enough not sure he did